All right, everybody, we're at the Henry Horton State Park. We're going to do the Hickory Ridge Trail. Um, going with the, the uh, using the All Trails app for this. Um, I ditched the jacket. It's like mid 40s. Feels pretty good out, actually. So, there's where we're leaving the truck. There's Trailhead. Looks like we have two markers here, orange and red. We'll figure it out as we go. Okay, from time restraints, that is the outer loop. This is the inner loop. And that's the one we're doing. Because I'm, like I said, I'm shooting other videos here today. But I want to get a hike in. And, uh, don't have to do a major hike I can do a simple hike I'm going the opposite direction than everybody else went <coughs> oh well <laughs> back on the other video and I'll put a link in it for video of what I'm calling discovering um, in your Horton State Park um, there will be some personal stuff and link in that video um, Wow what a muddy mess anyway <laughs> um, it's a pretty place though look at that so they're going the opposite direction I went. Just fine with me. Well marked trail. You should keep eye on the blazes. And they're very prevalent. Huh. Is that my one crazy tree of the Hike. Could be. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna get off here a minute and walk. Trail junction, outer loop goes the data way. Inner loop goes the data way. Sure, it's what it says. You get on this side of it. Yep, inner loop. That's the one we're doing. Orange. So I would take it. The orange is the outer loop. Red. That's a, what? That makes no sense. Anyway. Don't go by what I was fixing to say. But I think your your orange is your inner loop and red's the outer loop. What I was trying to say. But when they combine, you get the orange and red loop. Orange and red markers together. Hey. Had another up. Can you tell? Breathing. 
Look how slick that looks. <laughs> Matter of fact, look at that footprint. We're gonna avoid that one. Okay, here's a good example of something. Friends always hold friends up when they fall down. Get it? Anyway, I thought I'd put that out there. Um, ran across a track back yonder that uh, we've seen a few of in this channel, and it was really fresh. Deer track. So I've been going kind of quietly until now in hopes, let's see, said deer. But I haven't seen the tracks come back across the trail, so that tells me they're somewhere out there in that area for now. This trail is really not that bad. You have your ups and you have your downs and still say uh, Bledsoe. Bledsoe had its ups. <laughs> I would say Henry Horton has its, a few of its ups, but anyway. Never hike when it's dry. Well, I do from time to time. For the most part, when I hit a trail, it usually got mud here lately. Huh, look at there, got to grab that tree. Poison ivy vine growing up it. And that's a half a mile marker too. So we're a quarter, ooh, quarter of a way done on this trail. It's a short one. But I'm doing a lot here today, so short trails. All right, I'm gonna stop talking and start walking. Unless I find critters or something. Uh, there's sinkhole. But then look at this down to here. Hey, by the way, if you were on uh, this trail and lost your uh, beanie, there it is. Somebody found it for you. <laughs> this is really cool. As long as my old feet keep up and do what they're supposed to do and don't try to go out from under me, we're in good shape. <sighs> huh. It's not as deep as it looks. If you were, when you're up there. There it is. Alright. Trudge on. Alright. Another sink. This one looks like it goes pretty deep on that end. I may walk around and see what we can see. Oh, there's water running off in there. That's pretty cool. Um, let me get repositioned. Okay. You can see down there. Water's running off, and it's actually formed icicles. That's pretty neat. That's pretty deep. I can't see the bottom. And I'm not getting any closer to the edge because you know how I am about heights. Suck at it. <coughs> anyway, it's pretty crazy. They don't go down too far. But then, wow, over here. Another one. Over there. 
And over here, it's all part of the same thing, I'm sure. Same little system of crevasses, and I'm sure some caves. That goes pretty deep down there in that valley. It's pretty neat. See, if I hadn't taken this today, I wouldn't have seen this. So what happens when you get outside and explore a little bit. Look at that. And it goes down there on this side. That's uh, pretty sweet. Okay, I think the trail goes that way, but I'm gonna kind of go up and I'm gonna take the easier path, so they say. It's been a cool trail, it really has. It's been a really cool trail. Yeah, I'm, I'm off trail a little bit. As I came up the easy way. I would say this is... They wanted you to come up through there. And, no. There's our trail markers. It is loaded with trail markers. Well, that's neat. That deserves a picture. Look at that. There's some people down in there too. It's pretty cool. I didn't know this existed here like this. Pretty sweet. Okay, we're bringing the slarshing of the trail <laughs> to an end on this trail here at uh, Henry Horton State Park. So I figured I'd close it out right here. This video in particular. Uh, don't forget to uh, check the links down below. I'm sure I reminded you in the beginning. I remind you here at the end too. Um, Please subscribe, 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 share, and like it. Share it with your friends, co-workers, whoever you want to. I sure would appreciate it. I would appreciate everybody hitting that subscribe button and hits that bell icon. So you don't know the next time I'm falling down the trail. Alright guys, that's it for this one. Car's over there. Be prepared.